Hi, hello, welcome to this learning module on anatomy. In this module, we shall look at the terminology, anatomy and dissection. We shall also define what is human anatomy. We can also look at some subdivisions of human anatomy. And we shall also define body positions, especially anatomical position. The meaning of anatomy is upon cutting. Ana means upon, tome means cutting. Anatone is actually a Greek terminology coined by Aristotle 2300 years ago. Just like that, dissection is a Latin terminology. Dice means put apart. Secare is to cut. Dissection is a technique. Anatomy is a wide, vast subject. Human body is made up of different tissues and organs. How can we define human anatomy? Human anatomy is study of structures of the human body and the relationships of its constituent parts to each other. These are the subdivisions of human anatomy, gross anatomy, microscopic anatomy or histology, developmental anatomy or embryology, topographic anatomy or surface anatomy, radiological anatomy and genetics. Gross anatomy is naked eye observation of cadavers. It's a macroscopic anatomy. It can be learned systemic or in regional way. In systemic gross anatomy, cardiovascular system, central nervous system, respiratory system, digestive system, musculoskeletal system, like this different systems of human body are dealt with in order. In regional anatomy, particular region is taken, say limb, thorax, abdomen, pelvis, head or neck. In that particular region, what are all the systems involved are studied at one time. During normal routine dissections, we are following this regional anatomy. Microscopic anatomy is histology, where different tissues of the human body are studied under the microscope. Developmental anatomy is embryology. Here, normal process or normal phases of development and changes that happen in tissue and organs of the body at different time intervals are studied. Topographic anatomy is surface anatomy. Here, the parts of the body are projected onto the surface. In other words, once you have the knowledge of topographic anatomy, you will be able to outline the different organs of the human body on the surface. Radiological anatomy is study of deeper organs in living. Genetics deals with chromosomes, genes and even molecular levels of structural organization. Let us look at body positions. Supine position, prone position. These are lying down positions. Supine position is lying down, face directed upward. Prone position is lying down, face directed downwards. Usually, supine and prone are the positions of cadavers in dissection hall during practical dissections but when we explain about the structures and different organs in the body we do it with relation to anatomical position of the body so what is anatomical position of the body it's human body standing erect arms by the side, face and palm facing forward, lower limbs parallel to each other, toes pointing forward, 
eyes looking at infinity all the body structures and their relationship to each other are described in relation to the body being in anatomical position even in dissection hall when cadaver is in supine position upper part of the body means head end front of the body means the face side thank you for watching this video how fun learning human anatomy